Tropical storm Wanda, forming in early November, became the 21st named storm of the Atlantic hurricane season. Well, Wanda is not expected to pose a danger to land, Wanda's formation means we have officially exhausted the list of names used to identify storms, and this is the second time in two years that that's happened. Okay, first of all, what happened to X, Y, and Z? Or if you're doing the math, for the letter Q or U for that matter, well, in the Atlantic Hurricane Basin, there are just not enough names that begin with those letters for the list that gets rotated every six years. After Wanda, the National Weather Service will use a list of supplemental names. It's only the third time it has had to do that. The first year was in 2005. Last year, there was a record-breaking 30 named storms, including six major hurricanes, forcing meteorologists to use Greek letters to identify the final nine storms. But in March, citing confusion among the general public, the World Meteorological Organization said it would no longer use the Greek alphabet to label storms and would instead rely on a supplemental list of 21 new names beginning with Adria, Braylon, and Caridad and ending with Viviana and Will. Hopefully we won't get there, but the links between hurricanes and climate change are becoming more apparent. A warming planet can expect stronger hurricanes over time and a higher incident of the most powerful storms. The overall number of storms though, not increasing in the records we have because of factors like stronger wind shear as keeping those weaker storms from actually forming. Hurricanes are also becoming wetter because of more water vapor in a warmer atmosphere and rising sea levels are contributing to higher storm surge, the most destructive element of tropical cyclones. It's been a busy hurricane season in the Atlantic Ocean this year as well, and there's still a few more weeks to go until it officially ends on November 30th. And now, you're Science Smart. If you have a science question on your mind, send me a tweet and I'll try to get it answered.